welcome back to my channel. Today I have, oh, what do you think I'm posting? A, a try on haul, maybe? Yeah, so basically I know I do this disclaimer in a lot of my try on hauls, but I do post a ton of these. A, because I'm clothing obsessed. B, because I get to work with a lot of brands and obviously I love doing that. And C, I get so many requests for these videos and I understand that some of you don't like seeing so many try on hauls or you get, get annoyed with them. So what I've decided that I'm going to do is when I post try on hauls, I make sure I post other videos in between them that aren't try on hauls. So that way I am posting them, but I'm also giving you guys a more, more of a variety of videos. So yeah, I have been posting videos that aren't hauls, so if you're interested in those, go check them out. But I'm not going to stop doing hauls because there are so many people that like them. Before I get into this try on haul video, if you guys are not following me on social media and you want to, I will put my Instagram on the screen. I will put my other handles down below. And I will be linking everything in this video in the description box. So if you guys want anything, the links will be there. Please be sure to like and comment on this video if you like it because these videos do take a lot of energy and time to film. Trying on all this stuff doesn't take like five minutes. <laughs> it takes a while. So just keep that in mind. I do these for you guys. I know you like them. So if you guys do like them, some feedback, some comments and likes would be much appreciated. By the way, if you're wondering what's on my hand, it's a henna. The girl who did it for me is friends with my roommate. So I'm going to put her Instagram on the screen as well as in the, in the <laughs> description. I can't speak today. But yeah, you guys should totally go follow her, check her out and tell her I sent you. Okay, so the store I'm going to start off with first is Urban Outfitters. Okay, so I got some denim from Urban, which I am really, really excited about. So these ones are super cool. I've never had a pair of jeans that are this color. They are the Girlfriend High Rise, and they're kind of like an ivory. They look white on camera, but they're an ivory color. And then they go down, they have some rips in the knees. The bottoms are distressed, which I really like, and they kind of have like almost an acid wash. I don't know if you're going to be able to see on camera, but at the bottom they have a little bit of like a splattering effect. It's really hard to see, but it's definitely there. And these are really cool. They're very unique. So I'm excited to style these. Next is the Mom High Rise. And these are just like a washed black color. They're not super dark. They're more of like a gray, which I like. And they're just kind of like your average boyfriend mom style jean. The bottoms are cuffed and these are just so, so comfortable. And I love high-waisted pants. I literally only wear high-waisted pants because they just cover the food baby, you know, all those rolls. <laughs> Okay, these jeans I am in love with. I didn't take the tags off yet. I, w I wanted to wear these, but I wanted to leave the tags on for the video. But these are the Mom High Rise once again, except these ones are destroyed. And these are so, such, so, such, what? These are so high-waisted. I love them. And then they have some little rips on the back as well. Last pair of jeans are the Girlfriend jean. These ones, I have not tried these on yet, but I think they're just going to be more of like a skinny fit, but not like super, super tight. So these are just kind of like a mid, mid, medium wash denim. They're high rise, which is amazing. And then they just go down like this. So yeah. Okay. Another denim piece. I've seen a few YouTubers haul this. Okay. So this jacket is super cool. I actually wore it in some pictures that I took on the 4th of July. So I'll put those here, but it's awesome. It's basically this like different colored denim toned jacket. I got a size extra small and it's kind of just like cropped but also loose. This is just so fun and it's just very different. I really like it and I think it's just like a fun kind of statement piece but it still goes with like so much. I've been obsessed with stripes lately. <laughs> this isn't a size small. It's this really cute little striped crop top from Urban. Love this. This is going to go well with so many things. Basically my staple outfit for going out or going anywhere is a little crop top with high-waisted jeans. So this is great. Going with the trend right now. Once again with the little crop top trend. This is in this beautiful tomato red color. I am in love with red right now. I think it's so flattering. I used to think it looked so bad on me, but now I've changed my mind and I think red looks good on everyone. So it's this really cute little cropped smocked <laughs> off the shoulder top. The sleeves are adorable. Last top from Urban is this cute little floral off the shoulder baby. <laughs> Ew, why did I just call it a baby? I hate myself. Anyways, the shoulders are kind of poofy, but it's really cute right now. I just think this is going to be great. Once again, a nice little crop top to wear. Okay, moving into the dresses and rompers. I got this white romper. I thought this would match with so much. It's just this little like mock wrap dress romper 
And I got it in white because, like I said, it'll match a ton. It kind of ties in the front and looks like a wrap dress. And the material on this is so, so soft. So I definitely, definitely recommend this. I know they have this in a bunch of colors. I've really been into jumpsuits lately, and I love that a lot of jumpsuits are cropped because I'm so short. So normally I can't go with the jumpsuit trend, but because they've been cropped lately, I can totally jump on the bandwagon. So I got this black jumpsuit, but it looks more like a washed black, so it's not straight like jet black but anyways it looks like this it has these thin straps it's that same really soft material and then it just goes out into these flared cropped pants this is going to match with so much and it's going to be so comfortable and airy and breezy for the summer and the back is kind of low and strappy so i think this is just like a staple piece if you want to try out the jumpsuit trend this one's pretty basic but it's so soft and it'll go with so much going along with me saying that i like the cropped jumpsuit trend i've also been loving midi dresses I don't know, I used to think they were such a weird length, but lately I've been obsessed with them. So I picked up this floral midi dress, and it's just really, really flowy, super loose, super girly. And then the back has this really cute detailing, these little um, rings on the straps. I don't know, I just thought that was a little something. Okay, and the last thing from Urban is probably my favorite. I wanted this for a while and I think it's so cute. It's another jumpsuit. So yeah, it's a strapless jumpsuit. It cinches at the waist and then it goes down into the same kind of cropped pants. I think this will look so cute with a denim jacket and I'm loving the colors together in this. Okay, moving on, I got some stuff from Misguided. And before I forget, I do have a code for Misguided. It's Tasha30 and that is 30% off everything, excluding sale. So that's a pretty good deal. I'll put that here as well as in the description. You guys should totally, totally check that out. <laughs> okay, first thing I got are some nipple petal pasties. I love these things. These are great for small boobs because we don't really need a bra for support. But if you don't want to nip, because I don't know about you guys, but I constantly am nipping. I can be hot and I'll be nipping. So these are great, up to 25 uses, lovely. I'll show you the shoes I got from Misguided. So first are these little babies. I've been wanting a pair of shoes like this for a while. These are just black faux suede heels with a little ankle strap. I think these match so many things. I have a pair like this in nude that I wear a lot. So I thought I would pick these up. And then I also grabbed these really, really cute studded sandals. They're just black sandals with some gold studs on them. Just a little, a little something more than just your plain black sandals. So I thought these were really cute. Okay guys, so I did something a little bit crazy. I got the same set from Misguided in four colors. I can explain, okay? First of all, it was petite which means it'll probably fit me because I'm really short. Second of all, I just thought it was really cute and it's gonna be perfect for going out. And third of all, all the colors were amazing. <laughs> so I guess I'll show you what it is first. The first color I'm gonna show you is the craziest color. It's so out of my comfort zone, but yellow is really in and I really like it. So basically it's just this bandage set. So it comes with a bandage top. Okay, and then it comes with a little bandage skirt to match. So I just think this looks so cute together, you know, for going out or for like events or whatever because it's really, really flattering. You can see a little bit of skin and this color is so fun. I need to be like really tan before I wear this. <laughs> so, of course I had to get it in black. Here's the top. And then I'm really dumb and accidentally got two of the skirt. <laughs> but here's the skirt. I think my favorite color that I got it in is this nude blush pink color. So there's the top. And then here is the little skirt. <laughs> oh, we are not done. One more. I got it in red because, like I was saying, I'm loving red right now. And I think it's just such a statement color. And yes, here is the skirt. So this is not the thickest bandage material I've ever felt. It's not, you know, super thick and, like, sucking you in like most bandage things are. But for the price, this was, like, super affordable. I think it's fine and it's still really flattering and I like it a lot. Oh my gosh, I got another striped jumpsuit. What a surprise. Okay, so this one is, I think it's black. Yeah, black and pink and white striped. There's a little like ruffly thing up here. And then once again, the little cropped jumpsuit legs. This is so light and airy. And once again, it's gonna be perfect for the hot weather. I picked up this skirt mainly for work. Um, I work from home, so I don't really have to dress from work, but sometimes, like I did, a few weeks ago, I went to San Francisco to work for a week, so I wanted more like professional clothes 
or just things that are more conservative because I do wear a lot of like mini dresses and mini skirts and crop tops. So this skirt was just like a little bit longer than my normal skirts. It's basically this black skirt and then it has this really pretty sequin embroidery on it. I just thought it was something different and it looks a little bit more fancy and it is a longer length so yeah I know some people are probably going to be like that's still really short <laughs> um, but it is longer than what I have and I think it's appropriate for the office that I work in. Okay I got this dress probably for you know going out or events if I go to like invites or whatever in college but it's this faux suede dress with these silver studs on it. Really cool, really flattering. The material is like pretty thick on this one, which is what I like with tight fitting stuff. And there's still the sequins, or not the sequins, like the studs on the back. One of my biggest pet peeves is when things have things on the front and not the back. Actually that skirt is like that, but I'll get over it. <laughs> the last two things I got are striped. This one, I don't know how I feel about it. I'm not obsessed with it. There's nothing wrong with it. I just don't, I don't love it. Let me know what you guys think. It's this little romper. It looks like this. It needs to be ironed. <laughs> but it has kind of like a little overlay. And then it goes down into shorts. I think this one runs a little bit small. It's a little bit tighter on me than I would want. I got a zero. Uh, so yeah, I would get a size up, I'd say. And then the back is just normal. Okay, another striped romper. <laughs> it looks like this. Has little off-the-shoulder sleeves. And then goes into shorts. The material on this one is really, really thin, but I think if I wear nude underwear, it'll be fine because it's still really cute. Last thing from Misguided, I got a, like a three pack of gray socks because I'm always losing my socks. Like I always lose one sock. Okay, the last store in this haul video is Necessary Clothing and I got so many striped things. Oh my gosh, you guys probably think I'm insane. All right, so first is this awesome, I'm gonna say awesome, not cute, <laughs> striped romper, white and light blue, and then these little guys in the front tie, I thought this was so adorable, so yeah, and this one has built-in pads, so you don't need to worry about bras or nipping or whatever. Okay, I also got this denim skirt from Necessary Clothing, I actually wore this yesterday on the 4th of July. I'm trying to button it. So it's this two-tone denim mini skirt. This is so cool and so trendy right now. I love it. It has a light wash and a dark wash and it's just distressed and stuff. So yeah, this was super cute for the 4th and just really good with a lot of outfits. Oh boy, more stripes. <laughs> Another striped romper. Who am I? Uh, this one is cool as well. It's more structured. It's black and white stripes. It has this little cutout guy in the middle. And then these little off the shoulder ties and then the back zips and this one also has pads so no need to worry about the nips ladies <laughs> oh guys um another another striped romper <laughs> I hate myself <laughs> so I really don't know how to show this when I pulled it out of the package I was really confused as to how this is supposed to work so yeah we'll see once I try it on I don't really know what's going on here but um <laughs> I swear it looked cute online so We'll see if it looks cute on me. I picked up these two-toned jeans from Necessary Clothing. I haven't tried these on yet, so I'm hoping they're not too big, but they look super, super cool. Kind of like the skirt, but just like the jean version. So yeah, I'm super stoked about these. All right, last striped thing in this haul <laughs> is this little pair of striped shorts. They came with a top, or they didn't come with a top. You could have bought the top, but I didn't because I just thought I'd wear like a white top with them, but the top with them would be so cute as well. So they look like this. They have some ties, which I love on shorts. And yeah, I just think these will go with a lot. And as you all know by now, I'm loving stripes right now. So <laughs> yeah, almost done. I found these really cute shorts and I wanted these because they reminded me a lot of one teaspoon shorts. There's a pair of one teaspoon shorts that look very similar to these, but they're so expensive. And I didn't want to pay a lot for something that was like embroidered like this and trendy, you know? So I got these. They're basically black and they have floral. And what I love is the floral extents the back on the back pockets. Once again, I just think that's a great detail. Oh my gosh. I just realized that one stud is missing. Hmm. Maybe it's just sitting in my bed somewhere. I'm gonna have to look. Okay, and the very last thing in this haul video is another red crop top. I love this so much. 
I think it's so cute. I know it's kind of similar to the one from Urban, but like I said, my staple going out outfit is high-waisted pants and a crop top, so I can never get enough crop tops. This one is just red, it has some really cute ruffles, and this one feels really nicely made. It feels like it's really nice quality, so yeah, I'm really, really excited to wear this little guy. Yay, so that is everything in this haul video. If you guys made it through this entire haul, please comment down below and tell me that you made it. Also comment down below and tell me what your favorite thing was that I got in this haul. I'm seriously in love with all of it, so I would love to hear what you guys like the best. I love you guys so much. Thank you for always sticking with me, and stay tuned for more videos. Bye!